Greetings, opera lovers everywhere. Today, we have a rare treat in store, for we are presenting the immortal classic Das Seltzimmer Paar, which you may know as La Coppia de Versa, or somewhat vulgarly in English, The Odd Couple. We are especially fortunate in that two great operatic masters, Tony Randall and Jack Klugman, have kindly consented to perform this masterpiece for us today. You can imagine the excitement we all feel here. We are beside ourselves. Now, a hush of almost unbearable expectancy falls over the audience as maestro Roland Shaw makes his way to the podium. He graciously bows and raises his baton. In the opening scene of this great poignant work, Felix is just returning from a three-day weekend in the country. I've been away on a three-day weekend out in the country air. Though it's back to a tie and a shirt again, I feel so alive and alert again. I can even face Oscar's dirt again. Oscar's dirt. Meanwhile, Oscar has been having a three-day weekend of his own. I've been playing poker for three days straight And though my eyes are open, I don't feel that great But Felix will be home soon, and if that's the case I guess I'd better tidy up the place Empty all the ashtrays in the chip bowl, just like this. Then take the butts and chips and drop them in the dip bowl, just like this. I wonder if this curry is still okay. It's turned a very interesting shade of gray. I'll throw the chips and butts and dips in the curry. Better clean this place in a hurry. Felix will be home in a worry if the place ain't neat. I brought us What did you brought us? Some flowers Fresh from the country Aren't they lovely? Yet a divine I'll put them in water before they wilt Hey, don't go in there just yet The place isn't as neat as you'd want it to be And I hate to see you upset Nonsense, Oscar. How bad could it be? That depends on your sensitivity. I think I should see for myself, old sport. Oh! <coughs> Le Fleur, so mort. You've killed them! Well, if that is what this place can do to flowers, for myself I hold out very little hope. Between the smoke and the trash, I broke out in a rash, and my nerves are at the end of their rope. Come on, Felix. A little dirt won't hurt you. A little spill won't kill you. A speck of dust, a tiny stain. Why should it drive you so insane, Felix? Because, because, because I'm neat. Do you know what neat is, Oscar? I'm sure you're gonna tell me. Neat is picking clothes up off the floor. Neat is knowing what a mop is for. Neat is putting polish on your boot. Neat is never sleeping in your suit. Neat is once a week you comb the hair left on your head. Neat is never storing empty beer cans in your bed. 
neat as what I've been since I was just a tiny tot. And Oscar, neat as everything that you are not. Okay, I'm sorry. Sorry won't do. What do you want then? That's up to you. Could you learn to keep house like I do? Are you kidding? Then it looks like you and I are through. Are you kidding? When it comes to breaking up a friendship, I don't kid. Breaking up a friendship? That's exactly what you did. Since this is your apartment, there is nothing left to say. I'll go away. I'll go, you stay. You stay, I'll go. Oh no, oh no. I will not stay another day. Oh no, you'll stay, I'll go away. I'll go, you stay. I'll go, you stay. I'll go, you stay. I'll go, you stay. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What the hell? So Oscar packed his dirty things and left, and Felix cleaned up after him. A few days went by. I'm lonely, I'm clean, but I'm lonely. Golly, if only Oscar were here now. I miss him, why should I miss him? He was untidy, he was a slob. At the same time, Oscar sits in his dismal hotel room. Wild horses never could drag me back To live with that weird hypochondriac Yet there is an emptiness way down deep I miss that immaculate dream Maybe I'll pick up a phone and call him Maybe I'll pick up a phone and call him Oscar? Felix? Felix? Oscar? You've got a whole bunch of mail piling up here, so why don't you come pick it up? I'll pick it up. He'll pick it up. And when I do, and when he does, I'll give him the shock of his life! The next day, Oscar, dressed as neatly as an undertaker, comes to the apartment with a bouquet of flowers. The place is a mess and Felix is dressed like a slob. Oscar? Felix? Is that you? Are you sure, Oscar, it's you? Are you sure, Felix, it's you? But you're not the you I once knew. Neither are you. Look, Felix, I brought you some flowers, fresh from the florist. They're artificial, so how could they mort? How can a flower survive in here? Why are you living this way? It smells like there's nothing alive in here. Even a pig wouldn't stay. Remember what you told me, Oscar? What did I told A little dirt won't hurt you. Yeah, but this... A little spill won't kill you. Yeah, but this... A speck of dust. Yeah, but... A tiny stain. Yeah, but... Why should it drive you so insane, Oscar? Because I'm neat. Do you know what neat is, Felix? Need is picking clothes up off the floor. What are you doing? Need is knowing what a mop is for. I can't believe my eyes. Need is putting polish on your boot. The shine is blinding. Need is never sleeping in your suit. Clean and pressed and perfect. Oscar, Oscar, why are you doing this? For you, Felix. For me, Oscar. That's nice. Welcome home, Oscar. It's good to be back. Things will be different. We'll both try harder. No disagreements. No misunderstandings. Cause we are friends.